This little guy up here is the Kentish Plover. It is a type of shorebird that has a very, very wide geographical and environmental distribution. It's found very, very widely all the way from Cape Verde in Africa through a bunch of northern African areas up all the way into Europe along the coastal areas of countries like Spain, France, and Germany, down into the Middle East, through many areas in Asia, such as India and China. It ranges pretty much everything but Oceania and the Americas. They also inhabit a wide variety of environmental conditions, usually preferring salty coastal water or salt marshes or brackish lakes. Kind of any coastal area with a good amount of sand and salt and all of that, but they're not very picky about the location of these areas, which can be anywhere from hot desert regions all the way up into the tundra. They are quite an adaptable little bird, and they do quite prefer kind of wetland marsh areas, but will nest kind of anywhere that is suitable. They also do prefer to be away from human habitation, which does make sense since they are ground nesting and therefore at risk from their nests being stepped on or hunted by dogs. They've also been noted to move their nests and chicks to a better suited area if the place that they were before becomes unsuitable due to more disturbances or lack of food or whatever, they will just pick up their chicks and be like, okay, we're moving on. And that usually does correspond to higher survival rates of the chicks as well as overall healthier chicks. They are also pretty migratory, being found in different regions during different parts of the year and usually returning to the same or similar spots for breeding. And their normal flock size ranges to max about 30, but there have been some seen over 200 individuals. Their diet is also quite varied, largely invertebrates such as insects, insect larvae, worms, and snails. So in addition to being quite cute, the Kentish Plover really is a very interesting bird with a very good survival tactics and is very, very adaptable to most conditions, which is really cool.